hello students welcome back to the second video of this playlist so in this video uh, we will be solving question number two from the most recent past paper of statistics one which is the october 2024 s1 paper so let's see uh, what's the question number two from this paper is about so you can see the question number two on the screen so let's get started with the second question from the S1 October 2024 paper. So question 2 says a biologist records the length y centimeter and the weight wkg of 50 rabbits. Okay, the number of uh, data is here 50. Okay, the following summary statistics are calculated for these data. So the following summary statistics are the sum of y, the sum of the their lengths, uh, sum of y squared the sum of square of their lengths which is 81,938.5 and then sum of their weight it is 125 and s of ww the summary statistic of ww it is what 72.25 and s of yw which is the summary statistic of yw it, it is what 219.55 okay fine so Part A1 is asking to show that summary statistic of YY it is what? 734. Okay, so we need to find out S of YY. Okay, so what's the formula for finding S of YY? It is what? Sum of Y squared minus sum of YY, sum, uh, sum of Y whole squared over what? N, right? If you don't know the formula, no problem. You can check it out from the s1 part of your uh, of the formula booklet that will be provided in the exam hall so here you go sum of y squared minus sum of y whole squared over what n okay so we will use this formula all the values are given there sum of y squared is 81938.5 81938.5 minus what uh, sum of y whole squared which is 2015 2015 whole squared over n is what 50 55 right or 50 50 is it is it is 50 okay now just calculate s of yy what you will get 81938.5 minus 2015 squared over 50 so it gives you exactly 730 Four. And that's what exactly part A1 has asked to show. Fine. Next is part A2. In part A2, the question is asking to calculate the product moment correlation coefficient, that is PMCC, for these data. Give your answer to three decimal places. PMCC, the product moment correlation coefficient, which measures the what? Correlation of a data, isn't it? Okay, so the formula for PMCC it is what R R equals to what some S of X Y S of X Y the value for S of X Y Okay, here it is Y W which is 219.55 over square root of S of Y Y Which is 2015 Is it 2015? No S of yy, yy, we got 734 just in part A times S of yw, which is 219. Okay, S of y, not yw, S of ww, 72.25. Okay, it is 72.25. So, what would be the value? What would be the value for R? Use your calculator to find out the value. 219.55 divide square root of 734 times 72.25 so that gives us what 0 0.95338 something so we have to round the value to what three significant figures which gives you 0 0.953 okay so if you don't know the formula for uh, PMCC it's not a problem you can check it out from the formula booklet in the S1 part of, of, of the booklet. Okay, so you don't need to memorize it. It will be given in the 
formula what booklet okay and yeah that's the part a2 where we got the value for pmcc it is 0 0.953 and that's the end of part a2 fine okay next is part b in part b the question is asking to Im interpret your value of the product moment correlation coefficient that means we need to explain like uh, what the value of pmcc that, that we found in part a2 it represents okay so we got the value for r the pmcc it is what 0 0.953 which is closer to 1 that means it has a strong positive correlation so most of the students think will will think here to write that it is what a strong positive correlation no you don't need to like say that what what does this uh what what's the correlation they didn't ask for the correlation they say to interpret it okay you need to explain it what does it signifies or what does it represents okay so what does it represents in the context of the question that means what we will say since it is a strong positive correlation so we can say that uh it, its interpretation will be if y okay the length y and the w weight okay if the length of the rabbit increases then what w also increases right if y increases w increases that's it okay so we can write on average okay on average on average for each for each extra centimeter centimeter meter increase of length okay length length is what which variable y for each extra centimeter increase of length y the weight of what rabbit rabbits which is weight weight is what weight weight is variable w okay rabbits what increases that's basically the interpretation of the the value of pmcc fine and that's what exactly part b has asked for fine okay next is part c in part c the question says the biologist believes that a linear regression model may be appropriate to describe these data okay so part C is asking to state with a reason whether or not your value of the product moment correlation coefficient is consistent with the biologist's belief. Okay, so whether it is what it is uh, relatable with the belief of the biologist. Okay, the value for PMCC that we got it is what 0 0.953, which is closer to what one. So since it's closer to one. So what we can say definitely a uh, linear regression model will be perfect right so for part c what we think yes it is what it is uh reliable isn't it consistent yeah so yes yes it is consistent Con uh, consistent why it is consistent the reason is that since what r is closer to what one that's why okay so that's what part c of question number two has asked for fine okay next is part d in part d the question is asking to find the equation of the regression line of w on y giving you an answer in the form w equals to a plus b y okay so that means we need to find out the equation the regression line equation of w on y so the equation format is given w equals to what a plus b y right okay so we know that regression line equation for part d regression line equation is always in the form of what y equals to a plus b x so it is given in the formula booklet okay where b equals to which is the what uh, b is basically the gradient right so b 
is s of uh, x y over s of x x if i'm not wrong it's given in the formula booklet you can check it out from the formula booklet uh, it's given here as what uh, look here you go s of x y over s of x x fine so okay so here w and on x right so w equals to a plus what b x right isn't this the equation w equals to a plus b y not x b y so in this case b would be what s of w y over s of what uh, here it is x x so th that is s of y y fine so s of w y what's the value for s of w y it's uh, 219.55 219.55 divide what s of y y what's the value for s of y y it's basically 734 right so 734 so the value for b it's what 219.219.55 over 734 that would give you uh what uh it's basically in it gives you 4391 over 14680 so we got the value for b okay now uh the value for what a we need to find out the value for a so for regression line equation a equals to what y bar minus b times x bar okay so that means the value for a here would be what w bar minus b times y bar right so w bar it means the mean mean of w so what would be the value for a w bar the mean of w where is w okay 125 over 50 w bar is 125 over what 50 minus the value for b is 4391 over 14680 use the exact value to get the exact answer keep it in mind so sum of y is 2015 2015 over what 50 so what would be the value for a the value for a it would be 2015 over 50 okay so 125 over 50 minus the that value 4391 over 14680 times 2015 over 50 so that would give you negative what 9.554311 what 989 9. okay so we got the value for a we got the value for b so regression line of w on y is what we got w equals to negative 9.55 three significant figures plus the value for b it's what uh, 4391 over 14680 okay 4391 over 14680 okay so this is basically in uh decimal values it will be 0 0.299 y that's it so we got the regression line of w on y and that's what part d of question number two has asked for fine okay next is part e in part e the question is asked uh, the question says jeff has a pet rabbit of length 45 centimeter okay fine the length is 45 centimeter that means what's uh, length is given by which uh, variable w or y y okay so y equals to what 45 right okay so part e is asking to use the regression equation to estimate the weight of jeff's rabbit so this is pretty straightforward right we will just consider what for part e y equals to what 45 right 
if y goes to 45 we will just substitute the value of y into the regression line equation so negative 9.55 plus 0 0.299 times what 45 okay so what would be the value here the value would be uh, negative 9.55 plus what 0 0.299 times 45 so that would give you uh, that is 3.905 okay 30 3.905 so you can say to uh, three significant figures 3.91 what kg right the weight it is in kg so that means Jeff's Jeff's uh, rabbit its weight is 3.91 kg that's it and that's the end of question number two from the October 2024 S1 paper fine